Luigi, everybody! Welcome to Replayed, where today we are playing a little game that um, you may never have heard of, you may never have seen a musical about, um, but today's your lucky day, if that's true, because today you're going to hear about it and hopefully you saw a <coughs> musical about it. Um, I'm AJ, I play Stanley in our new Stanley Parable musical, which is called, oh, I hear audio, uh, A Proper End. It just launched today on Random Encounters. Please go check it out. And if you didn't know, we make a musical every single month. I'm finding a lot of people going, I haven't seen anything from you guys yeah, in forever. I saw a comment in the, the video today that was like, I'm here AJ, every month. good to see you, man. I haven't seen you in years. I spent and 10 I'm like, years being here literally We're here every, every month. month on Random Encounters. Every week used to be. There's like 120 music so. videos I've made. So uh, anyway, we're here every... Uh, hi, Nate. How are you doing I'm today? Nate, by the way. Hi, I'm Nate. I'm here as well every month. You're also here every month. And you and I are here on Replayed every Friday here with That's right. Um, also here with us every Friday on Replayed. Is it me? Am it's our I good friend Gwen. Every Friday? Our narrator. Hi, Gwen. <laughs> oh, I'm the narrator? AJ and Gwen, or AJ and Nate, <laughs> I sat in myself. front of a TV playing a video game. Mm. Mm, they were going to lose. Repeatedly, you but that's okay. Lose. Uh, but yeah, the Stanley Parable has no losers. It has endings, but no losers. You're right. We're all winners when we're playing the Stanley Parable. <laughs> Everybody knows this. Um, uh, we got a couple other people to introduce. We Some do. people in the chat, I believe. Uh, I'm going to be hanging out in the chat along with our two moderators, Malcatonio and Neffenjo. We're just going to be helping uh, enforce some of the rules, like no swearing, Ooh. no spamming, uh, no being mean to each other. Uh, and we're also going to be uh, answering some questions. If you have one, put the word question in all caps and the words after it. And uh, Especially questions about the Stanley Parable exactly. or uh, our musical about it, A Proper End. Uh, and I'm going to be passing some of those questions along to AJ and me as well. Woo! I'm going to say, they're probably wondering why we're wearing headphones, because we don't normally do that on Replayed. No, we don't. This game actually, if, you haven't, if you've seen our musical, you know that there's a narrator. That is the majority of this game, is a guy, you know, telling you, telling how to play. you about things and stuff. And yeah. So it's actually important to hear the dialogue. Yes. And a lot of the games that we play, we just don't care. <laughs> we, we talk right over it. We but make we do it, actually need to hear it today. Yeah, so, so we're going to try to pay attention to the game a little bit more than usual. Um, I also wanted to throw out there that the Stupendium makes a, awesome music videos as well on YouTube, and you probably watch a number. Hopefully you're subscribed to him. He is our narrator, but he is not the narrator in the game. So you might notice the voice is just a little bit different. Still a fancy British fellow. Um, <laughs> different British person, though. So we're all going to enjoy a slightly different, but do go check out the musical and check out his channel if you want uh, a different take on some fun uh, British singing. It's really not, it's almost more spoken for a lot of it, but either way, is, but Greg he did a great job. job. We uh, were lucky to have him. Or singing, so he's good. True. Um, last group of people we have to introduce today will be our Patreon sponsors, our Patreon encounterers. The last people of the June. The last people of June. Let's, let's, they let's get out of here. Jesse and Marissa Tidwell. <laughs> Jens Betting. <laughs> SDC Hawks. <laughs> I'm Michelle Kushner. Shadowbender197. That's it. That's it. Thank you guys for backing the channel. That if you want to join them it. in the future, either backing our musicals or even just uh, episodes of Replayed here, you'll find the link for the uh, Patreon page right down in the description below. And we do cool stuff like show them updates. They got to hear the song a little bit early. They've seen little bits of what we're working on next, um, which a lot of you were supposed to. We had a trailer that was supposed to premiere today before the musical, and it didn't. I couldn't put it, uh, put it up. Uh, yeah, YouTube, YouTube broke. was uh, not cooperating. But then AJ... Got a hold of YouTube and they're like, "Have you tried clearing your cache settings?" Like, I have tried. I think that have now you tried started. clearing your cache <laughs> settings? Uh, so anyway, uh, Patreon knows a little bit more about what we're heading uh, into next. They also get cool things like trading cards, free music, um, stuff like that. So I would say if you don't follow us on Instagram, follow us there because I think EJ mentioned maybe. I said I might post that there, teaser there. So yeah. Keep an eye on it. I even looked at it last night at like what one in the morning, and I laughed and said, "This is a little obvious, isn't it?" Like usually our like little trailers before the premieres are a little bit more vague. You have to like, oh, I can imagine a, a video game that has woods in it or things like that. The color yellow. This one was like, I don't know how people aren't going to get this one. <laughs> so we'll see. Uh, maybe we'll post that, and it had a little cool advertisement for some of our music on it as well. Okay. We've talked, we've yacked, we promoted uh, the Stupendium. I think it's time to play the Stanley Parable. I think Parable. it is time to play the Stanley Parable. Can we begin the game? I think we are. Let's uh, begin the game. Begin the game. Yeah, silence. I've been listening to Office Chatter for a while. <laughs> this All is right. the story of a man named Stanley. I can't imagine such a story as this. Stanley worked for a company in a big building oh. where he was employee Build buildings are my favorite. Ah. This is like my job. This is a true story based on my life. Oh, sure. Simple. I worked for social media in a company. Uh, this is more boring than what my job looked like, though. Let us know if you're having trouble hearing us or him if they're not loud enough. Sure. 
how long to push them. All right, so Stanley's job. All about this pushing them buttons. Sorry, employee 427 if you prefer. Don't want to be, you know, maybe he prefers that. Would you consider it soul ending? Every moment that the job is Though we have been made Depends on what you're allowed to do. Like listen to music? He doesn't have headphones or anything. Was happy. We're was told happy. Stanley was happy by the narrator. And the narrator. One day, something very peculiar happened. Uh oh. Something that would peculiar forever things. change Stanley. Something he would <laughs> for the next ten minutes forget. while we do a single run through. He had been at his desk for nearly this is an him. Hour. This when is me. Realized that not one Got my tie, which he doesn't have a tie. Had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up Interesting. to give him instructions <laughs> for a meeting. This is different from our musical, you might notice, too. Never in it's not this button stopped working. Company, he just doesn't get any orders. This complete That's true, because isolation. all his co-workers disappeared. But Something since he was, was working on our musical, normal. he wouldn't have noticed Shocked. if his co-workers disappeared. Exactly, like no one was on the Zoom call? <laughs> That'd be weird. See, I'm jealous. I wish all of my co-workers would disappear. Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> oh. Rude. He got up from his desk and Are you up from your desk? I am up from my desk. I'm going to step out of my office. Are you? Oh, you can move. Okay, I was starting. I wasn't sure if it was gonna. Here I am. All right. All of his coworkers were gone. Now, what if you've played mean? this game before, Stand let us know what some of your favorite endings room. are, and maybe Gwen will help us pull um, an ending to a, a, a strive for. I think we were gonna try to oh, find I'm... one of the ones from the musical. Something too. we aspire to do. It's true. We're gonna favor, I think, ones from our musical, so you can see some of the references. Hmm. All right. All right. So we're just going hmm. to the meeting room. Is that what they told us to do? Supposedly. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, <coughs> he uh -huh. entered the door on his left. On his left. Sure. Let's follow it. Let's, this will take us to an ending that I think... Oh, it won't, will it? I don't know. We don't reference this ending particularly. Yet there was huh. not a single person here either. Huh. Not a single person. Feeling away disbelief. Stanley okay. decided to go up to his boss's office, <laughs> hoping he might find it's an like answer It's like some music lyrics for us. Hey, our favorite room is right here, though. Perhaps we should. Perhaps we should enjoy a little time in the broom closet. Stanley first. stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. Stanley did that, I'm sure. I'm sure he did that. Hey, we have one of those. There was nothing here. No choice to make, no path to follow. Not Just an empty cars, broom though. closet. No. <laughs> no reason to still be here. That sounds really ominous. When is there any reason to still be standing in here? Uh, well, the chat told you to just stand here, so. What? They don't want us. Yeah, they, they still really just want you to chill. I think you've had a long, hard week. He wasn't even doing anything. Out in the room closet. At least if there was something to interact with, he'd be justified in some way. As huh. it is, he's literally just standing there doing sweet F.A. Hey, we're taking it all in. We're enjoying the ambiance. Uh, exactly are you what all are you really you? Oh, still in the room closet? closet? That already, Standing uh, around doing nothing? What a nice room closet. Please Wait. offer me some explanation He's, here. he's actually talking to us confused. now. This is the first time that the narrator has addressed us instead of just talking about us. Ooh. He's got mm -hmm. a lot of duct tape. realize there's no choice or anything in here, right? <laughs> Maybe I want to just be in here, man. Stanley like walked it. past the broom closet. At least you uh, the chat would like to know how long it took to, to push out. every single button at the end of the musical. Me because literally, this <sighs> Not that long at the rate I was going. Uh, uh, yeah, at the rate he was going, story, half the buttons were flying off the wall. <laughs> I never would have thought to they weren't very well stuck to the wall, were they? <laughs> if you're going to push them all carefully, I would say it would take you Maybe two, to three you minutes. This is somehow its own branching there are a few. Maybe Did you have to do multiple takes of that? Oh, yeah. Tons. Did you I get the them. broom closet ending? The broom closet ending was my favorite. Well, it's my favorite. Find this That's like the British accent I like to do. Yes. <laughs> Did you get the broom closet ending? The broom closet Stanley ending was, was my and favorite. Really stupid. Hey. He probably only got the job because of a family connection. What? That's how stupid he is. That all with drug money. Also, Stanley is addicted to drugs and hookers. No, you are, uh, Mr. Who narrator. Isn't? Who isn't? I oh. mean. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Well, I've come to a very good conclusion here. about what's going on right now. You're dead. Uh, I'm you clearly moving around. Closet, You're dead. A bit, and we're just about to leave. You just passed away in the room closet. When a physical malady of some uh -oh. sort shut down your central nervous system, <laughs> and you can <laughs> just because we're not doing what the narrator wants. Now we're this, dead. The responsible thing is to alert hmm. someone nearby so okay. as to ensure that your body is taken care of. When begins to we're yes. told that we're dead. We're dead. You're dead. Hello? Anyone who happens to be nearby, the person uh, at this computer don't pay attention to dead. him. 
He doesn't know what he's talking about. We're alive. To any number of your I promise we're still alive. <laughs> he's a liar. We're alive. Still here. Look, I can move uh, and everything. I'm breathing. From the area huh. and instruct another human he doesn't to even know how he died? The computer, I, oh. they understand basic I'm going to be like, I guess I'm going to leave the game uh, <laughs> Oh, no, no. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Just trolling. <laughs> So uh, you don't have to do any of this. Of this game I promise it's not lost on us, there. and we're not right. dead. When you've done that, just step out into the hallway. Uh, no. We are we are fully alive. I promise. We are recalcitrant. Right, when, when do I, leave? And I think now is a good time stubborn. to leave. To right. be honest, I think. Yeah, I think you can. Ah, second player. It's good to have you on board. I think you should I go back. Actually. You can't do any worse than the person who came before you. Wait, does he really think he replaced you? I can't. Yeah. No, you go back in the room closet. Oh, back yeah. in the room closet. You <laughs> too. Unbelievable. <laughs> I'm at the mercy of an entire species of invalids. Hey! There's a monkey nearby. You can have How dare you? Too. How dare you, Fish, sir? Fungus. Um, well, you there's a fern. The details. Yeah, right. I'm not particularly picky. Uh, the fern is in the trash. For when you're ready to pick up the <gasps> you like the fern? Sorry, the fern is actually in the lawn waste. Uh, it hadn't been watered in like three days, and the peanut look was eating it. <laughs> you can leave again now. Okay. Huh. Uh, we had a discussion about what the fern was supposed to be named. Kimberly. It was named fern. Kimberly. Oh, you named it. See, I, I said it was, its name Coming was Fernie Sanders. Stanley walked and it was, upstairs to once again, asking us office. not to feed it to the cats. To my boss's office? But if I go downstairs? literally, it had the name Kimberly on the fern when we bought it. It had the name Kimberly. You're right. It's a Kimberly fern. But Stanley fern. just couldn't do it. Well, this he is one ending. The possibility of facing his boss, not the same ending. Admitting he had left his post during work hours. Uh, admitting we sat in the broom closet and for half an hour waiting for the day to end. Why had he taken that risk? All uh, this because is he believed everyone Yeah, this will just loop for the next half hour, so. Think he was Everybody sit back, enjoy and the scenery. To Stanley. Maybe, mm. he thought to himself, maybe, maybe I, I am crazy. Maybe. All of my co-workers we make YouTube videos mysteriously about video games. In a single That's moment crazy. No reason at all. That's a pretty crazy thing None to do. Made huh. any logical sense. No, and as no, Stanley I didn't. pondered this, he began mm. to make other strange observations. Are you making any strange example, observations here? Why couldn't he see his feet when Can he looked down? Feet? Well, I can't see Nate's feet. Close automatically behind him wherever he went. That's just and the doors all closed behind these us. These rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Well, this Starting. <laughs> no, I think we said that like ten this minutes ago. Too strange. This can't be real. Can't be real. At last, he came mm. to the conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. He tip just of our hadn't tongues. found the words for it. I'm, I'm dreaming. dreaming. He yelled. This is all a dream. This is all a dream. Oh, what a relief. Is Sam it all a dream, Gwen? To have finally found an answer. An explanation. This is a nightmare. His co workers weren't being stuck in a, a filing cabinet. He wasn't it was a nightmare, Mr. Job. Be he wasn't crazy after all. <laughs> That's true. That's how my nightmare thought to himself. I suppose I'll wake up. I feel up like I have dreams semi frequently about my last my jobs. Boring like, real life job pushing buttons. I may as well Do you want to hear about my dream from last night? Oh, no. what Sorry, I said we weren't going to talk about the narrative. Uh, I'll get to it in a second. began to gently float above the ground. Oh, then hey. he imagined himself Very soaring cool. through space on a magical oh. star field. And it too appeared. Cool. It was so much fun. And See, why can we control this stuff? We can't like control like the doors opened for me and I went back to work. And then perhaps huh. the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's I want to get in this car One, and he was away. amazed he hadn't asked But you have to go through the wall soon. and drive away. <laughs> Why is there a voice in my head hmm. dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Can you go the other way? Now no, the, the door is shut was behind describing you, okay. itself being considered by Stanley. Yeah, you can't go back, particularly so. strange. can only go one I'm way. I'm dreaming right. about a voice describing me thinking about yes. how it's describing the voice thoughts, describing thought. itself and while he thought it in my thought very now. odd and wondered if this voice spoke to mm -hmm. all people in their yes. dreams well, doesn't it the truth <laughs> was that of course this was not a uh voice. this guy how is so be? into himself was he's Stanley like let me describe stanley himself, thinking about believing me. that if who does that asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility who does that uh-huh like stanley hmm, is i'll bet gwen is right thinking now. right now about aj across the room going what a handsome fellow now he is! He yes, I'll bet she's really enticed with him. After all, I am now. he knew for certain oh, no. beyond a doubt that See, this I made that happen in a dream. I think that was Did a little bit of don't think about people. Make the magical about. stars <laughs> just a moment ago. How else would the voice explain all that? Oh, oh, this this voice was a part of himself too. Nate, why surely, you take surely, if he could I just... didn't mean to. <laughs> he would prove it. He We're gonna prove it. That he was in control. This is a dream, obviously. Nate, prove it's a dream. He closed his eyes gently. Yeah. And he invited himself to wake up. 
We're just gonna he felt close our eyes. Weight of the blanket on its skin. Yes, that's right. The press ah. of the, the blanket. On oh, back Perfect. when I was asleep the fresh this morning. Air of a world outside oh this yes, one. the fresh air that was not coming through the window because it's too hot outside. Up. I was gonna he say it was like a hundred degrees. The dream I was having last night was about the Sonic the Hedgehog movie, uh, the second one, the sequel coming out. Let me yeah. I dreamed we got invited to it and went to it. It was terrible. Like they didn't bring back James Marsden. They didn't bring back like Jim Carrey. Tails wasn't in the movie at all. And Sonic my was only in it for like 15 minutes brushing his teeth really fast. And that was like the only exactly scene with Sonic the in it. And then they asked us after like, so what'd you guys think of it? Do you like normal. it? We we're like, I am normal. no, <laughs> no, I didn't. Be fine. <laughs> it wasn't very good uh, actually. Uh, All right. Everything's going to be fine. Okay. We're okay. The Sonic movie is not out. This new one is not out and it will be better than that. I'm sure. Here we are. There, our dream is over. Oh. Is it over? Yes. Stanley began screaming. No. Please, it's not someone better. wake me up. It's not My better. name is Stanley. I have huh. a boss. I have an office. I am real. Please, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 hasn't real. come out yet. I must be real. I must and it's still going to have the same actors. I swear. Yo, it was kind of a nightmare. I was like, don't do my boy Sonic like this, especially not on his birthday. You can't have made this movie and like dropped half the cast. And like, it was this like they the had no budget and just gave up. Mariella. Oh, good. What? All right. We're going to start what? a new one. No. Mariella All right. So our next playthrough was like with Mariella. She arose, got dressed, cool. gathered her right. belongings, and Sounds walked good. to her place oh. of work. But oh, on no. this particular day, her walk huh. was interrupted by the body by of a man, man who had stumbled a through town guy talking and screaming to himself. And then oh, collapsed dead, dead on the sidewalk. Crazy dead guy. <laughs> she would soon turn yeah, to call okay. for an ambulance, you know? for just a few brief moments, she considered Take his wallet. Get it. Run! No! Kick him no. in the ribs! No! 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 Don't do this. Everyone That's very poor behavior. Like. Here in and civilized moment, society, she thought to we herself check how lucky to see if he's alive, then call an ambulance. And then take his wallet. Then call an ambulance. And I then take his wallet. And never and take his it? wallet. <laughs> it was comforting to think this, and in a certain way, you haven't found too many dead people on the street, have you? Have and you? you the I, she had scheduled for I know one dead person. We need to have a discussion right now. If you <laughs> took a wallet from a dead person on the street. <laughs> the rest of no, I have <laughs> time for this. So it was only a moment. All right, everyone in the chat, please join me in shaming AJ body. for trying to look and like a badder guy than he is. I got to do something to stay interested, okay? <laughs> We've been watching this dead guy out face down on the pavement for a while. The dead guy is us. We're the, the dead the guy. The dead guy is us, yeah. We're the true, dead guy. And um, we start over again. The chat has been asking in a variety of ways uh, what it was like to work with Mr. Meowse on this project. And oh, and here's how... what they're going to ask about working with the stipendium, but they want to know what the cat. <laughs> the cat probably was less... Uh, cooperative? Cooperative, yes, thank you. Then the stipendium? So anything I'm we shocked. asked of, of the stipendium was probably a very simple, <laughs> easy peasy thing to do. By the way, there's an ending if we just stand in here and refuse to leave. Well, if you would like That's to talk about ending, so. both Mr. Meows and the stipendium, you may Names, do so in whatever order you would like. You can cover oh, Mr. Meows, I think. What was Mr. Meows was to go to the meeting room. delightful pain in the butt. <laughs> we like Mr. Meows, but he we had a first day of shooting with him. Or we tried to entice him with like treats went and like his toy to get his attention, in the office, but, but it just didn't work. So we filmed with him the next day and we used the story a laser anyway. pointer uh, to get his attention, which worked much better. I don't know, look at like the monitor and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, the footage that we got is like it. Oh, like what we used was the we best of the usable the stuff. I also I noticed Take when I was watching it earlier times. that one is of the that cat all that you think an was achievement played is worth? backwards. No, no, no. no. Yes. I can't just There's give definitely these away for some backwards shots. Uh, which I feel like is actually one of our, our long-standing tricks now, of playing things you backwards with the cat. 20 times. I would say that's right. the kind We're trying to gain this achievement. Alright, 20 times. Open the door! Open the door! In the name of Stanley! I'm still not feeling the satisfaction Listen of to me! Listen to me! For a noble cause. Uh, Perhaps 50 clicks. 50 clicks! Almost certainly 50 clicks. It's like a Mario Party game now. <laughs> Open the door! Let me in! A beast is out here. I'm still not feeling it. I, I want this achievement to have meant oh. something. It has yeah. to be a, a true oh. reward for valiant uh -huh. effort. Yeah. I want to see some hustle, Stanley. Oh. I want to see commitment. That was hustle. A willingness to go all the way, no matter I what it cost. Why don't you go put 20 clicks into <sighs> door number 417? Am I going the right way or the wrong way? Uh, yeah, they get lower. As you Good, okay. I'm going the right way. 417. Oh, great. There we go. Now, go <coughs> a few times on door 437. All right. We're going back to 437. 
We're gonna click on that one a couple times. That's right there. Excellent. I think we're getting somewhere. Four now, 15. door 415. Let's okay. give it 10 clicks or so. <laughs> what a good use of replay today. Hello, welcome to Replayed, where today we're just impressing the narrator I a little mean, bit. We're playing the Stanley Parable. Oh, that's <laughs> what he wants us to four, do. Three, seven. Oh, yeah, all, all right. right. You couldn't have put these doors together or something. Just put them out of order for this achievement. No, he wants you Come to have on. a true effort to earn this achievement. Oh, he's making me bust my butt. Let's see. How about you click on, well, I don't know. The copy machine. I got you. I got you, buddy. All right. I'm feeling it. Room 417. I'm really feeling it yes, now. Yes. I think we're getting I'm somewhere. on the page with you. I'm really feeling it. Yes, we can do this. I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you to the end of the line. Okay. Now yes. go climb on employee 419's Four, nine. desk. You can't climb. That is right here. Oh, yes, yes I can. This oh. is great. Oh. I'm better than that. On the line, Stanley. I like that. I sure right, am. Let's keep it I'm going to get fired Don't for give this. Give me a few clicks on door 416. We I got you. Almost got I got you. It. Now the copy machine. We're gonna do it. We're going to do it. We got this. We got this. I really wanted the end of this for us to have like, played right the there. Macarena. No, it's in the next room. The next one. Oh, no. We're losing ground. We got this. We got this. All right. Here we go. Finish it off, Stanley. Five clicks on <laughs> this door. So do it. Yes! yes! We did it. We did it. Wow. We did it. That felt amazing. Oh, you really are, <laughs> Stanley. Nothing could a... hold you back. Yes, I was proud very of how exciting. far we've come today. Right? Just it's uh, uh, it's infectious. Ago, you believed an achievement. You kind of excited. Five little uh, really now. Since what we were really clicking buttons thinking. and stuff, the chat wants to know what your favorite button to push at your job is. Uh, favorite button to push at my job? Correct. On Random Encounters, what is your favorite button to push? Export. I was thinking <laughs> that about means it. You're done with the project. I was thinking about it. I feel like the music side times is more fun, but um, I really like clicking the heart button next to people's comments. That Aww. makes me really happy to find a comment because it means not only am I getting to like show somebody I appreciate their thing, but it also means I have appreciated their thing. It means somebody wrote something that I thought was really smart or funny or cool. When Stanley came to all a right. set of two open doors, Gwen, what's your favorite he the button? Door on his left. I like all the buttons. Uh, hmm. I don't. Um, get us hmm. to an ending. Get us to an ending. Musical. All right, I can do that. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley button. knew it perfectly well. I don't think I well. have a button that I can Perhaps that he wanted to stop by oh, the employee wait, lounge wait, wait, wait. first. Is the on just button on my sewing machine a button? <laughs> sure. We'll go uh, with you that You just one. called it the on button. Wow. So clearly it's, it's yes. A button. <laughs> yeah, it's a this room. Oh, what a, what a beautiful gorgeous room. room. This room is gorgeous. What a gorgeous, gorgeous You guys see why we didn't film ours in an office? It's not even like one room of an office. It's like you need to experience this room. Which I know we've got like what felt like an entire school for consider. kindergarten too and stuff like that, but I feel like it's not easy. Case. This is a statement on how we've talked about doing the Stanley Parable before and not being able yes. to like replicate the office really, and stuff like that. Really mm. worth it and we felt like room. it was this year so was sort of the time to do it now even because everybody had become accustomed to like vanished, working from home because of the pandemic. And some so we were like, what if Stanley, you know, his job is so simple, he can do it from home. And it gives us the opportunity to film in a house instead of an office that we don't At have. At this point, yeah. Stanley's obsession with this room bordered on creepy. Uh, it reflected poorly on his overall personality. What? It did. It's it reflects very poorly on your personality. Oh. Uh, how long? <laughs> you could never been so burned. <laughs> how long did it take Everybody you to write a job or because me? he stood on a table a lot? I feel like they would just fire him. Waiting for more dialogue. <laughs> but when a long time had passed, and how long did it take you to write this musical? He decided that the game was trying to send him a message. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to like ignore this guy dissing me over here. Oh, uh, but it last, took not as long as I expected. Room, it was hard to do some of the lyrics. But the music came to together in probably like two days, maybe three. I was gonna say I thought overall it actually took you a really short amount of time. Yeah. I feel like the music was done in like two days, and the lyrics, you had a bunch mm -hmm. of it done on the first day, and then kind of like in a wall. wandered through the last Stanley half so of the song. Bad at the following next, like, directions, two or three. it's incredible. But it, it wasn't, wasn't five it wasn't years bad. ago. I feel like I've seen you beat your head against a wall way more than on True. this song. Uh, so here's a question. We have two branching paths that are both in our musical here. It's time to let the audience make a choice. Uh -huh. uh, are we going to go uh, attempt to find the room with the phone in it, or are we going to go find the room with the baby? Ah, phone or this baby. Choice. Your two favorite things in the world, but which one will we phone choose? Baby. A, phone a phone baby. baby. We can't have a baby them both. Phone. <laughs> we can't have them both. I will say that there's probably more we can do with the uh, baby route because it will branch us into at least one other thing included in the musical 
Whereas the phone might be terminal. As in it ends our path, not that we die from it. <laughs> Although we could die from the phone direction if we wanted to. Uh, wow, I'm just like leaving you guys all this. Spoilers. Yeah. It is you guys. almost 99% baby. Probably. baby. All right. Go find the baby. We're going to go find the baby. We're going to extend the stream to four we'll hours and the I baby ending. We, <laughs> we are We're gonna not going to do the baby ending. No! Oh, really oh sorry. I was confused with the I baby ending. I realize that investing in your trust in someone right. else It's a good thing this guy's not our enemy. But the enemy. fact is that the story has been about nothing but you nothing but all us. this time. Oh, There's that's some, great, what? but... Really? I don't, uh, don't want to go wherever in the middle of something. What you is the most boring job we would willingly for work at? Are you that convinced that I want something the bad to happen The most boring job we would willingly work at? I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really <laughs> okay, do. So Playing this game on a live stream. <laughs> I have to diss the narrator so, back. <laughs> so my old job, one of my old jobs back in New York, was I worked at a place that uh, they were working on digitizing court doc, like old court records. Mm -hmm. So my job was literally to just take paper and send it through a scanner for eight hours a day, oh and then gosh. to basically look at it and make sure it like looked proper. It didn't like jam. It didn't scan it poorly. It was boring. <laughs> it was mind numbing. It does sound pretty bad. Soul rending is even called. Listen carefully. It. This I feel is like important. the first part of my work study is uh, like freshman in college door. was literally to go through my boss's office and take uh -huh. out anything that was Perhaps before 1970 and shred Stanley it. Stanley walked through that the red door. That was fun. It was like door. two walls of, of filing cabinets that I just had to go through every single document and see what year it was from. I still don't think we're communicating properly. The red door. Stanley oh, walked oh, I was confused. The red door. The red just, just door. The it's fine. Just which is over here. We're gonna go through this. That's that's blue. Uh, that's this blue. is the red door. Baby blue. All right, fine. Go ahead. Baby Stanley. blue. I, I call it more so of a badly blue. what's out there. You want to find out what lies at the end of this ah. road you've chosen? Well, ah. don't let I do me want to find out. You. We're gonna we're gonna follow this path instead. You Sorry, see? buddy boy. There's nothing here. Oh, I haven't even finished building this section of the map because cool. you were never supposed to be here in the first like place. It. So my most boring job, I would say. Textures. Uh, Is this what you had wanted? Was there is a combination. The At my social media job, before I did that, I was subtitling you. exercise videos about like health and fitness workout stuff. And in the end, it was And it was so full of like. This is what you wanted. Oh, I can't even think of any of the words. It would be like. Help these strange and unknowable desires of yours. Uh, I always say like, oh yeah, you check like now strength, uh, lengthen the the external vertebrae of the whatever so cranial something. It was like it was things like that. It was like yes, now extend this over there and pull the the ventral lateral muscle of the something. It was things like that. Any of these instructions, guys? I was like, I had no idea what we were doing, and I was trying to. I had to stop and Google them constantly and be like, is this a word? Like, what are they saying? Because you just hear the instructor. You know, talk about lengthening this or hyperextending that, and like they're just like names of weird muscles or bones. <clears throat> and like I've never taken an anatomy course in my entire life, so I had no idea what we were talking about, and I was supposed to subtitle it. So that was terrible. Where you just for hours and hours, it was all day long, eight hours a day. I'd be sitting at this stupid computer trying to figure out what this you know fitness instructor was telling people to lengthen or extend or you know contractual whatever something, and it'd be like. <laughs> Musculo something skeleton something. I was like, I don't know what we're talking about. All right, so we got it's three like, doors. Go we got three doors. This is clearly the door that is the most interesting door. So I'm gonna go through that one and find ourselves a, a fun ending that is from our musical. Okay. Oh, oh not this yet. There. Now, everybody, tell me about your I need your help. With this new version. Help Would me you rate the experience. The benefited from I would give it a solid choices. negative 22. That's not an option. Well. <laughs> we have buttons one through five, and the narrator really cares what we enter. So, oh, right. which one are we going to pick, everybody? One, two, three, four, or five. Was adding that extra door for us to go through worth a five, a one, something in between? You know, be honest. Be honest. I want to know how much that really improved the game for everybody. You let me know. Personally, you know, it 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 was a it added an entire fifty percent more, so that's cool. Mm -hmm. We went from two to three. That's a huge improvement. But also, he didn't even bother to finish this with like texture. This room has no texture in it. Gosh darn it, narrator! It's like, put it's, some it's, texture. There's no story uh, like explaining the it. Walls. The uh, orange is more interesting, but it's technically just a placeholder. So I I don't know. I'm not sure he's putting a lot of work into it yet. I feel like you should know that apparently Random Encounters fans are kind of all in or all out. They're yeah. all putting either one or five. 
Well, um, do we have a... They're not I, all in on one thing? I think they also tend to be a positive group, so they're giving it a five. A five? Wow. All right. We just like when he gets enthusiastic. Aha. You see, I knew I was there onto something. Good Where job, buddy. Where do these flashes of inspiration come from? Yeah. I, I feel I like know a four the game with needed a, a, third a note door. that we needed texture well, would have been better. But that would have been better. A calling in your gut. That's all I right. really couldn't say where the idea came from, except We're just that trying to butter this guy I up a little bit. in my soul. We want him to feel you valid. That so... Don't even try. We tried oh. helping. Yeah, based on the data from your previous playthrough, right. I've compiled cool. a new version. And to be uh -huh. perfectly candid... We got a new version, everybody. Here we go. Oh, We're gonna let Nate Excellent. play the new version. Let's ah. take a look. Okay. okay. So... I would just take the... I mean, we could try a different door, but I think... Mm. The, Oh, you got the leaderboard. Wait, 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 wait. We're on the leaderboard. We made the leaderboard, everybody. Good old Congratulations. Woo! History has been made. You were right here when replayed, made it to the Stanley Parable leaderboard. Um. We are here. Here. There we are. That's us. Wow. We made the leaderboard. We're yes. We're in the top 10,000. We cool. did so great. Nice we did great. Now. Would you say that competitive <laughs> leaderboard helps uh -huh. you feel motivated okay, another choice. walking through doors? Again, honest answer. Give please. us an honest answer. Was All that right. leaderboard beneficial? Did you feel more excited to be playing Stanley Parable with us today, knowing we made the leaderboard? One, two, three, four, five, 9,428 or something. But How do you generally feel about leaderboards? Because I don't like them. Don't like them? Especially when they're, like, worldwide. I feel oh. oddly like I have to defeat every human on the planet. <laughs> That's because you're a weird competitive person that wants to defeat every human person. on the planet. I prefer uh, leaderboards where it's like everyone in my living room. Can I please? Yeah, be it's true. Than that? As competitive as I feel personally, I don't like leaderboards because I'm never as competitive as half the internet is. Mm -hmm. Like other people will play the same game as I am, but they'll play it for like hundreds of hours and all have tinkered with it for 15 and minutes. People just have too much time on their hands. Yeah, so like I, I'm less of a fan of leaderboards now that I professionally do YouTube and I can't actually just come home from work and play a game. That used to be part of my life. I used to come home and just finish games. I used to complete games like almost every week and I never complete anything. I barely play anything anymore except here on replay. Um, what do we got? I assume we're probably uh, getting a five again. Uh, we're Dude, actually, really we're going to give them a three because apparently they heard me and they decided that they had to board. not be I'm so extreme. Forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on. Oh, I don't even know they really care. would be a lovely opportunity to give us. it some play testing. You wouldn't mind well, now we know something about our fans, at least. We do. Let me boot it up. I feel closer to them already. All right, so we're going to get a new game. All right, here we go. Here's an ending. In hey, this looks familiar. Baby crawls left towards danger. Great. Take the I love danger. To move him back to I the eat danger for breakfast. And if he Look at how happy fire, this baby is. It's a baby this baby's thing. like, I'm All so good. Alex like me as a baby. Except I was a fatter baby than that. <laughs> I and uh, I had those hair. We'll really Still do. Like, but of course, <laughs> I'm, I'm very biased, but I feel like you were cute in that. Once you've been playing it for about mm. four hours. So oh, why don't you so this is like Parent Simulator. To make sure I it's effective. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> parent Simulator. Nate, I hope you enjoy some Parent Simulator. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, don't like it either. Oh, watch out. Oh, that is a terrible sound. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> we'll just do it for four hours. No. There is no lie. You can get an achievement if you play this game long enough. So if you do this for four hours, you will get a cool extra ending. Oh, you monster. Oh, oh, my heart skipped a beat. What you need to do is you need Ooh, to get one of those uh, mm. little bird dipper things that Homer Simpson has. Mm -hmm. it's, 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 you know, in the episode <laughs> where he becomes fat and wears a moo moo. <laughs> they just sit there and keep pressing the button on the keyboard for four hours. You can probably get like a, a macro that will like enter a button for you just constantly and then walk away for four hours. Oh, oh, what are you doing? But they make the game uh, more difficult at some point, so. Oh, that's right. You have like a dog or something. Yeah, so you end up with two things you're trying to keep. But honestly, the game doesn't get more interesting than this. Oh my gosh. It's going to basically be like this for two hours there and then you'll so get many, something new. So many people that would like us to allow to do this it. baby to. Um, oh, oh, you guys don't want us to see it. Oh, and here I was going to do an extra long episode of, of Replayed. Oh no! Come on, baby. Heartless bastard. <laughs> oh, oh, hey! Babies are yes. purely despised. No, we hate Both. the sound you made the, the buzzer do. What to do. I'm Plus, out of we don't ideas. have four hours I to play. I can't think oh, of a no. single thing that might improve the experience bop, bop, bop. for me. Uh, this is I'm the best game I did. He came up with. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. What a it's shame. Over. Thank you for playing. Your input yes. was extremely valuable. 
Oh, okay. Ha happy to help so you. Awful. Why don't we play someone else's game? We'll try somebody else's game. the pain. Yeah. Uh, speaking of someone else's game, do have mm -hmm. how do you guys feel about the, the current fan theory that is running rampant mm -hmm. amongst yes. encounters that like Morgo, after he Let's was finished with Little Misfortune, uh, invented a new game and entrapped Stanley in it? Hey, I like this game. Well, Stanley, we should have been playing this today. Last, <laughs> this is better. Thank you, narrator. A game I of course, without being able to jump. To do with. This is, uh, is it enough? Tell me that, um, I like this theory. It I think it's enough? it's a good theory. I, this, I can't confirm or deny it. Things for you. From now on, they do I will sound pretty darn similar. They do. Mm -hmm. I Perhaps feel like Morgo does I'm voice acting in this like, spare time. House. It's like a side gig. <laughs> I just feel like Morgo's goals of like trapping <laughs> children's <laughs> souls into another world yeah. no. is slightly yeah. different than then, whatever this uh, is. Unless uh, the office uh, is another world uh, and Stanley is in fact trapped uh, there. That makes sense. Does it need I? Uh, I like yes. this guy's just building the worst oh, house ever in Minecraft. This is like I'm not even good at Minecraft, but I have it's to say this is the worst house I've ever seen. I it's literally Stanley. a dirt hut. Look at it. Gaze upon my work of art and feel ashamed <laughs> He'll at open your the door own inadequacy. You have to wait. What's up, Dunhill? Ah, but you've only flower? seen it from oh, yeah, the outside. You've right. only gotten half the experience. Please yes, only half the experience. Step inside and make yourself comfortable. He's going to kill us in the grand. dirt shack. This is hey, where we die. Why would wow, you do that so roomy. Wait, what a beautiful... <laughs> We must <laughs> he slings so much diamond. like filth at us diamond this whole time, everything. picking on us, yes, picking yes, on yes. our decisions. Come along, we have to go. I can't way. help it but hate on his creation. He did a bad job. I'm just gonna call it what it is. That was a bad house. I've made a lot of terrible dirt huts I in like Minecraft. To someone's that was the worst end up one. Showing up to the stream like right now. <laughs> Like, like, Welcome everybody. to Minecraft, everybody. Minecraft? Hey, Jay, if you didn't catch our new Minecraft musical, it's on the main channel today. Go take a look at it. It's really good. No, 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 no. Oh, you better be careful. This is how you die down here. That's okay. There's going to be like spiders and creepers and all sorts of monsters. Uh, how did you pick which endings to I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Mm. Something that makes you feel utterly irrelevant. That's usually how you do it all. One out of five. Even the diamonds can save this one. Okay, new game. What was, uh, how do we choose our endings? Correct. Um, basically things that we knew we could pull off, uh, or make a, like, an adaptation of in our house with our storyline. So, uh, things that got cut, for example, we had no monitor room, <laughs> which we haven't shown you guys in this ending. But. Yes! I oh, don't even I know what portal. this game is, but I love Well, we it. didn't do this either, because you this looks also harder to, to make a set. No Although, we could have done a bathroom Listening to me talk. Oh, it's inspired. But it's not good enough to have a bathroom. You really want, like, a portal gun or a companion myself. cube. And our what companion cube got burned up at the end of the musical, as you guys might remember. it out. Ooh, so, okay, yeah, we basically curious. looked for ways to end the, um, the explosion the ending that we went with. Actually should have been probably too hard for us, but we knew we could adapt it to be a simpler version where it was just Stanley's bedroom with some buttons instead of a, a massive... Maybe we'll get to it uh, before the end of the episode today. It's a, puzzle. Uh, a massive, like, Critical button chamber with a mind stand. control facility and stuff. You're 40. Oh, critical thinking. Hey, there you go. Jeez. Well done, buddy. I gotta finish my drink here. No, actually, you know what? I think that's no. plenty. We're not, really we're not gonna play this. You were having too much fun. <laughs> he noticed you having too much fun. Ooh. Ooh. And now you're down here in a broken area, which I believe is based on the Half-Life mod this game spawned from. Mm. That's like a weird dank. It is pretty dank. Well, there you go. We just knocked out a couple of the scenes from our, our video. Yeah. We should try so to get to the... people who uh, saw the musical that were... Oh, there I go. And then we died. Maybe. Oh. We're still here. We're st stuck here. And as I say, for the people who saw the musical and didn't understand why Minecraft was in it, <laughs> you now know. Yes. It wasn't just the SEO. Uh, so, obviously, we filmed huh. all of this musical at our house. Yes, we did. Uh, what Virtually. was the biggest change we had to make to the house in order to film today, or this musical? <sighs> That's a great question. Um, the biggest room, probably the streaming room here, actually. Our replayed set, all of our streaming computer stuff and sound tech over here, we didn't. Uh, we had to take down, and we had to move the desk down the hall and set up a different computer. This is like your own streaming area. <laughs> <laughs> I wish our studio space looked like this. That'd be so cool. Look at all the cool screens you would have. I, I laugh when people talk about having like multiple screens for their like streaming rigs and stuff. This room, this entire set has one screen. Two. Gwen brought her laptop in today. So we have a laptop as well as an actual computer. 
Yeah, but the laptop. If what he here wanted was to be the, the leading man in Did his own story, something? well, perhaps he's gotten it. Did you find anything down in wherever he is so. right now? Maybe what you were searching for was deep inside you choice. all along. That's and if he's always learned the, the case. heavy cost that comes mm -hmm. with it, huh. you'll understand soon. Maybe what, what you <laughs> wanted all along was to burn that baby and stop the noise. Someone who will wrap everything up at the end to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. That's who I am. That That's is what I, I mean am. to this world. That's what I mean yes. to this world. Yes, I'll be back. Yes. There's no other way. Is he a, a villain? Ends, is the narrator after evil? Comes to a close, Probably. Then I'll be back. He sounds like a villain. I'll be here soon. <laughs> he sounds Very definitely soon. like a villain. Hmm. Besides, he sounds friendly. Wait. Oh. How long are you going to make us wait? Do we have to restart the game? We might have to restart this one manually. Uh -uh. Oh, good. Okay. I was like, that's going to be miserable if we, if ah. we have to do that. And here we are. We're back now again. Where do you want to go? Uh, let's try to find the adventure line. Unless there's an ending everybody wants. Y'all let me know. When yeah, we got Stanley came to a set of two weird. open doors, he entered the door on his left. Uh, the adventure line... I can't remember how you do that. You have to... Yeah, I'm trying to remember what it takes to get the adventure line. I'm pretty sure we need to go through the, the left-hand side. I... No, I'm wrong about that. I was wrong about that. Maybe we'll do the explosion ending because I did just reference yeah, it. There was not a single it's another one from us either. Yeah, I Feeling think it might be the right. But you have to take the second Stanley left. decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might try find going back in the room closet. There. Go in the room closet. Oh no! Oh no! 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 There no! 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 Not again! <laughs> I won't be part of this. I'm not going to encourage you. I'm not Why going not? to say anything at all. Hey! It's like you're I'm just hey! Going you're to part of our team. Wait for you to you're long for the ride, buddy. It Sorry. Is you enjoy doing so much in this room. <laughs> it's true. Take he could just time. choose to go narrate for somebody else if Finish he doesn't like us saying whatever it is you like doing so much in this room. Hold on. Take your time. There's a bucket right here. Yeah. Why are you? Why would you go poopy on the floor when you could have used that bucket? Right. I assumed he was not Go going visit my boss, be. I guess. Coming yes. to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Our boss's office? Oh, no. Only bad things happen when you visit your boss. This guy's got a very posh office. Mmm. That's a, a bathroom we can't go in. That's my office. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> Apparently, it's not. Here we are. Our boss's Standing office. into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned cool. to discover not an indication huh. of any human life. Shocked, what you, unraveled, what Stanley doing? wondered in disbelief who huh. orchestrated this. What dark secret what was being dark held from him? Secret. What he could not what have known was that the key that anime behind the, book the boss's desk Is he guarded manga or the something? terrible <laughs> truth <laughs> I was like, what are been keeping from him. Oh, and no. so the boss had assigned it an extra secret oh, pin number. We have an extra secret pin number. Two, eight, four, five. Thank goodness he knows. But of course, Stanley, Stanley couldn't know. possibly have known this. No. There's no way we could possibly have known. Yet hey. incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons, random buttons. on the keypad, Stanley happened know? to input the correct code How unlikely. by sheer luck. Amazing. He stepped into the newly opened passageway. The newly opened passageway. Where oh, is it? Where did it open? Right there. Oh, there it is. There you go. I'm in a newly opened passageway. There you go. There you go. Cool. Good thing we didn't know that number, but we were able to just randomly push buttons on the, the pin pad. Oh, good. That we really worked it. out for us. For no reason. All right. We're going to have a, a choice coming up. A couple choices. Can you Stanley still type on the pin pad? He felt a bit peculiar. Huh? It was the chat wants you to type in a very specific chest. code three times. No, we have three to go back and do it. Oh, okay. To question the what code do they want? Is it eight 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 eight? Okay. <laughs> when for years, it had why? Never why do you know what code this they want? When, when I on work on these floor. musicals, I do a lot of research, okay? And there's an entire Wikipedia page on the Stanley Parable wiki for oh, the number no, eight. Straight ahead through the about this. number eight. The red mind control facility. Huh. So we have conflicting messages going on here. Escape or the mind control facility. Uh huh. I'll be real. The first time I played this. I had no idea why anybody would go into the mind control facility versus going toward the escape. But I now recognize how shady that escape sign actually looks. Yeah. Which is why in our musical, we made it a little more shady. It does look rather uh, hastily scribbled uh, together. So, we... audience, you get to choose. What does everybody watching want to do? Go into the mind control facility or 
gonna escape? I don't know. I don't know. I like you could still hear the clicking of a keyboard. Yeah, they just keep the same office ambience. Even though no one is in the office anymore. That's the oh, funny thing. Wait. It's like his coworkers leave. Does that mean that the narrator is typing something? Could be. Is the narrator the office worker in the sky? <laughs> he's the one that's like, he's typing game code as he's we go. He's typing on Discord right now to our fans. <laughs> uh, these stupid people are playing Stanley. They uh, keep going in all the wrong oh directions. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Super early, everyone wanted you to go to escape, but now everyone's turned to mind control, so give me one more sec. I think it's still escape. I think I think escape is. Okay. It's a little shady Although looking. this passageway had the word escape written on it, it does. the truth was that at the end of this hall, uh -huh. Stanley would meet his violent death. Uh -huh. I okay. mean, what is death if not an escape? <laughs> it's not false advertising. The door behind him was not shut. Huh. Stanley oh, still had every opportunity to turn around and get back huh. on track. Oh, interesting. At cool. this point, Stanley was making a conscious, <laughs> concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. Stay Yikes. Course. That is a... Uh, he's pretty dedicated. <clears throat> Stay you course. ready? Jumping in? Is this the incinerator? Uh, it's don't, something. Don't, don't do that. Here we go. We're jumping to our own death. This was a choice. Obviously, that escape sign is about all we included of this ending. Because doing the rest of this would be a little more difficult. What are you talking about? We could just film it in our uh, very convenient elevator shaft. Closer and closer to his oh yes, right. That his yes, life been we have no consequence whatsoever. Yes. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the huh. real story. Why did we do this? What was our what was our plan? What plan did we have? Was what was we have? Was what plan were you? From a blind man. Huh. So he resigned. So it was just kind of a, an impulsive decision. To his brief and shadow Here we go. Hey, it's our turn next. Did you just fall down into it? No, I ducked. I didn't know you could do that. Apparently Farewell, done. Stanley, cried the narrator, as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. <gasps> In a single Enormous visceral instant, jaws. Stanley was obliterated uh -oh. as the machine crushed every bone in his body, Yikes. killing him instantly. I distinctly remember that. Oh, except, he, except he no. Didn't. I love except no. certain words with British accents. And yet it would so be just good, a few like, minutes before Stanley yeah. would restart the, the narrator. game back in his office as alive as ever. Uh -huh. What exactly did the narrator oh. think he was going to accomplish? The yeah, narrator. for real, narrator. You're always picking when on every us. Every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance. Death Welcome to the museum, everybody. Another Making ending we did not include, same. actually. But we do did include the word escape, so that counts. Do you see that Stanley was already Isn't dead this all beautiful? the moment he hit start? They're just what? paintings hanging on the walls. There's the layout of the office. Stanley's computer. There you go. You can just see random props that they used. Order. Oh, uh -huh. cool. They have little factoids about them. Filing cabinets. I do like this what? as a feature. Why do they like Stanley so much, though, that they preserved literally his filing cabinets? <laughs> uh, he has the same filing cabinets as everybody else. I, I assume they actually can get crushed Stanley's in that thing. Stanley's filing cabinets. Uh, yes, you can You can still get crushed in it, by the way. You can choose not to duck. Uh, it doesn't matter if you duck. You can still get crushed in it. <laughs> Look at all these fancy things. Look them up. Oh, Ooh, listen to all the sounds, sounds that we can have for buttons. Hey, oh, these button people. sounds. Uh-huh. These are people that worked in the game. Uh, do you guys have a favorite ending, either from the musical or just in the game in general? Yes, I do. We're not going to, unfortunately, see mine because I'm pretty sure you can get demonetized for, for <gasps> doing it. It involves music that there's, oh, there's okay. a couple fun uh, music-related endings in this, but there's no way for us to post it without having the video claimed. So I'm not going to do it. But I can uh, encourage you to go find them yourselves. So get a copy of the game, and then, oh boy, what 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 is the way to get the one I was thinking of? I believe if you jump off to the catwalk like I did after going into the the right hand door at the split, and then you actually take the red door like he asks you to, mm -hmm. you will get one of my favorite endings, uh, which has a, a little bit of music, but it also has a really wacky kind of resolution to that. Uh, Storyline. The narrator's acting is fantastic in that one. Freedom ending. Mm. Also, if we go do the telephone ending at some point, there are two versions of the telephone ending, and one of those, again, might get demonetized, I'm not sure, um, but has a very silly uh, video you sit and watch for a bit, and that's Ooh. a good ending as well. 
Um, there's a lot of fun endings to go explore. So if this game kind of appeals to you and you want to have more of a thorough experience, I would encourage <laughs> you to, to take a look. Oh, look at these two. How oh. they wish to destroy one another. How On they wish to off. control one another. Oh. How they both wish Which to be free. Which one are you going to push? I mean, there's only one to push, I guess. You okay? Yeah. Can you see? Can, Can you, you see? see how much you see? they need one another? No, it's all black. <laughs> Put the no, screen back. Not. Sometimes these no. things cannot be seen. Not when you turn off all the picture. All right. But listen hey, to here we are now. You can still save these two. You can stop cool. the program before they both fail. Push escape uh, and press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. That is uh, forward, the only explanation. Someone else's path. Stop now and be your only true cool. choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Right. Oh, you want time choose for you. Yes. Don't let time Oh, that was Goodbye. us. That was us. Ouch time. Time chose for us. I don't really understand. Maybe there's a metaphor in there where it's like you go through the museum when you're about to die, like rethinking your whole life. But I don't know what the on and off is. Is it like like making your peace, basically being like I'm done with like my denial or my whatever? No, I think you have to restart this one. So you have to begin the game again. Yeah, I don't know. All right, find us something else, quick. Find us something else. How are we doing on time? Ten minutes. Ten minutes. All right. When Stanley uh, came to a set of two open books, this was take not this the correct one. way to the meeting room. And, and then I'm gonna see if I can find one of my other Perhaps favorite he wanted ones. wanted to stop by the employee lounge Which first. Also, just to I'm not sure this might be a demonetizable one as well. But we're gonna do it. Slime. We're gonna do it. Work of art. We're gonna do it. But eager to get back it's to too business. Good. Stanley took the first Yes, I am. I am eager to get back to business. Of course. Yes. And so he did come in here. through the maintenance section, walk straight ahead to the opposite door, no, and got back on track. We're gonna, get back on we're gonna track. ride this thing downstairs. <coughs> You're so bad at this thing down. looks more fun. Elevators are always more fun to go through than doors. Mm. Eh? But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. No, he, he didn't. Wanted to he wanted to wander about and get even further. Bad. Back. So now in order bad. to get back, he needed to go um. Uh oh, which way are we going? All right, buddy. From here. Where, where, where are we going? Left. Yes, yes, it is. Oh no! No, hey. it's to the right. My mistake. Hey! No, 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 no. We wanted to go left. Can you not? I'm just no, trying. To... No, Can no, you? No, no, not the right. He's so confused. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? You did what though. Was I thinking? You did. It's clearly. Uh, oh damn! Oh, oh, boy. All right. <coughs> Let's give this guy a second. He's uh, he's a little disorganized today. He wasn't expecting to be on a live stream. We went down this happens right, to people. Left, down, yes, left, we did. Right. That. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Okay. Yes. I've got yes. it. We got this it. All right. Story Good. Is absolutely, Good. Definitely. All right. Continuing. We're continuing get our story get here. Truck. No. Oh. You want to go through the truck? I don't think we can get in the truck. No. <laughs> Rod's van. <laughs> Rod's. <laughs> I'm going to kill some kids today. All right. Uh -oh. That made no sense no, unless you've no, seen our Rodney's. No, 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 this huh. isn't right at all. You're not right. supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick a stand, spoiler. close your eyes. Oh, 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 oh. Just Don't look. Just there we go. All right, no one look. Who am I this is a mistake. It's all rubbish now. The oh. whole story completely unusable. Oh, no. oh, rather than waste my time trying to yes. salvage this nonsense, this was a mistake. we'll just restart the game from the beginning. Again, this time, we're gonna try again. We don't want us we'll so far off track. Hmm? We're gonna get okay. a proper end. From the top. All right, that was my mistake. Sorry, that was that was not good. That was sorry. All of Here, this I'll let you take over. Gone. Oh. What could it mean? There you Stanley go. All right. To go to the Better meeting. ending now. Perhaps sorry, I messed it up. A memo. I messed it up. Hmm. Was that a door that was open back there? Just double check. Nope. Okay, it was the window. I saw the window. I thought you could walk through it. I was like, wait, 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 wait. Okay. All right, all right. We're gonna make this better now. When Stanley, wait, wait. wait. Uh oh. What? Uh oh. No, I restarted. Uh oh. I definitely restarted the game over. Completely <sighs> fresh. Everything should this be. This is wrong. It's oh, wrong, it's wrong, wrong. It's all wrong. Stanley, did you change Do you anything ever just when we were back in that room with all the Me? monitors? Yeah, did you move the story? Oh, I thought I was talking to him. <laughs> yes, I moved. Maybe a little, but he makes fun of me too much. I'm the one who wrote the story. Yeah, for real. Why are you asking me, Mr. Narrator? Like, you saw everywhere I've been. I didn't change anything. Okay, then. It's an adventure. Ridiculous. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Find the story. Find the story. Oh, yeah. Is it down here? This has got to be it. Is there a story? Is there a story? You're just going to go back. 
Here we are! No. We're gonna go in this one. Story? Anybody? Anybody leave a story here? There's gotta be a story here someplace, right? <laughs> eh? Should start looking mm -hmm. under chairs, behind picture frames, <laughs> I, in this filing cabinet. Are we getting closer? I'm actually questioning now. Maybe it's behind the plant. Is this like an actually fully modeled, like, is I'll it say, real space? This is the I think worst it is. adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you, I think definitely those are all real, so it's not like generating before. as you go. It's do we like, they all connect? Do we need to restart yeah. the game again? Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over um, and over again. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, um, let's give it a shot. I Why not? I wouldn't guarantee it's going to be better than that. <laughs> Time to restart the nightmare. Oh, okay. All right, it's got to be it. Gone. It's got to be it. It's got to be it. Mean? Stanley this decided is, to go to the one. meeting room. Perhaps he had simply Wait, missed a memo. Check, check. <laughs> is that it? No, that's a uh, that's another one. Okay, never mind. Never mind. You. Hey, man, you got you know got to keep your eyes open. Things change so rapidly in this game. All right, is it better? It's not okay. Better. Yep, it's worse. <sighs> I might be remembering this wrong. This guy. It's possible the story is back. This guy where we just came from. Why don't we go uh, back the other direction? All see right. If we see, anything. see, he's with me. He believes that you know maybe there's something that just. Well, I don't know. Sometimes you gotta. That's different now. Going back sometimes is going forward. You know. Eh. That makes sense, probably. Aha! I knew uh -huh. there was something. He seems to think there's something here. Here but... it comes. Oh, he found it behind the plant. No, I never mind. Not the story. <laughs> Okay, let's head back Oh, a dead end. Way. We were looking and for a dead end. We stops. found it. That's right. Does that count as a proper end? We found mm. an end. Does it count as proper? Oh, this, hey. Well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. <laughs> is this the story? I no. So. No, this I is not. I can't recall, but I believe not a proper story, story took place in an office building. It, is that correct? It did mm. take place in an office building. Do you remember, Stanley? It was the Stanley Parable. Well, do you know what? Since I've completely it's forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? This you guy. Win. You know, incompetent narrator is a thing that exists in I literature, but in hard, I'm but seeing it right in front of me here. So. We won, Good though. Job. Hey, we won. Congratulations, everybody. I think that deserves a like. Please hit the like button. Let oh, YouTube know we showed up and we won. Yay! You didn't put in any actual work for hey. that. Hey! 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 We've been playing and for like an hour. One of those situations. We've done all these other crazy hey. things. I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. This guy is unfair. This, this time, is like some like I 10 points to, to Gryffindor start. kind of BS. <laughs> like, I'm not okay with that. Uh -oh. There we go. All right. I've got a All solution. Right. This is gonna help time, us. time to make sure we don't get lost. Mm -hmm. I've employed the help of the Good. Stanley Parable I feel much, line. much Just better about this. Line. How simple Look at is how simple that? This is. this is great. This Why didn't we come up with this sooner? I want an adventure line for my entire life. You see? You should the have line one. Knows where the story yeah, is. Yeah, that's like what it's a guidance counselor is supposed to be. You're supposed to be the Gwen Pinkerton adventure line. Here's a thought. Wouldn't Wait. wherever we end up be our destination, uh -oh. even if don't, there's no story No, don't there. get into this. Or don't ask these philosophical way. questions. It's the story of no destination. Still a story. <laughs> if you <laughs> can, go for it. Moving forward, See, I'm, I'm just, he's just making it more confusing. Don't overthink it. Just accept it. Let it be what it is, by man. The very manifestation like, of the nature oh, of life itself. This is not oh, getting oh, oh, less unclear. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. I don't know where I was going with all that. You know what? So the line I is think what rambunctious. We need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. He is so right. We need a little bit of adventure line music. Adventure line, adventure line. Here is the adventure line. Gonna ride on the adventure line. Do you ride on the adventure line or just walk along the adventure line? Yes. Follow this adventure line. That way. This way. Go. Under the ceiling. Through the door. <laughs> go, Stanley. Go. Got the music. Oh. Go back and look at that fern. Go back. The fern? Go back and look All at the right. fern. Is it Kimberly? Oh, yeah. Stanley, this oh. fern will be very oh. important later in the story. Much bigger than our Make sure that, you that study it. That is a much bigger fern than you led me to believe it was. <coughs> you won't want to miss anything. You told me it was a little fern, so we bought a little fern. I didn't say let all. I just said it was a fern. You, you just picked up a palm. I... <laughs> and I was like, it's not a palm, it's a fern. <laughs> well, either way. A fern's a fern. Well, there goes our adventure line music. Aww. Bop, but our bop. adventure line's Wait, still look, here. We're back at the office. 
It's true, but I'm starting to no. doubt in Lion, the adventure line's You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, I just right? Think so. The story. I just want to get like far enough is that we find like a little like, like oh, troll no, rolling no, out the no, line. No, no, not again, Line. How could you have done I, this to us? And after we trusted you, line has after everything us. we've been through, you <sighs> can't line. take this anymore. To is there a pirate? Restart. Is there a pirate right there? There was. The adventure line. That was me. Stanley Parable adventure line. You had one job. Know what, Stanley. <laughs> I say forget the adventure line. What's I'm it with him. Done for us? The narrator knows what he's talking about. Right? Why yes, don't we make maybe. up our own story? Possibly. Something exciting, daring, mm. mysterious. Ooh, ooh, this all ooh. sounds perfectly doable. Sure. Why don't we not? simply start wandering in, well, I don't know. Uh, How about this direction? That direction. Yes. Oh, going off the rails. Now, it's like off roads. Yes. This is exciting. See? He's Just with us. Me and Stanley forging a new path, yeah. a new story. It's like a buddy cop movie. What do you want? To be a rom com to or something. Go wild. Mm. Use your imagination. Use your imagination. Whatever Nate. it might be, Stanley. Yes. I'm ready for it. I don't think pirates. Are you imagining a dead end? I I was. Was. No, not oh, you again. Oh no, Stanley. I'd also like to veto the mm. line from having any role in our awesome new Adventure story. Adventure line. No lines or monitor rooms. Just uh, don't acknowledge it. We should be fine. I want to ask the chat what they think of the adventure line. Would you uh, would you ignore it? Do you feel like it's ah, against us or with choice. us? We get to make a decision. Hmm. Hey. Here, the story is in our control. Our control. How important like we it. mustn't squander yes. the opportunity. True. In fact, I believe uh -huh. I need a minute to think here. Yeah, let me know Just in the chat if you're minute. with the adventure line okay. or dislike so the adventure I know line. That each door has to lead somewhere. I feel like I, I might be a pro adventure line person. I know it was chaotic, but it's like. I like chaos. It gave us purpose. It gave us a cool song. And it took us to see that first. That our <laughs> That's worth a lot to me. So I might be pro adventure line, even though it did lead us down so some wrong paths. From the right I mean, we can do that ourselves. So it's well, clearly on the same the wavelength right as we are. Thinks the way we think. That is the point of this game. Stanley Parable is a game for people like to think too hard about whatever there is they're doing. Victory for logic. Uh, the chat seems to love the line as well. Destiny. I think we oh, talked about All right, so we're all good. That's why I wanted to go see the line. I was like, I think the line is. Uh oh. Oh, hold up. What's oh this? no. Oh. Well, hmm. I think we found ourselves uh, ending. a little summary of how to play this game. That's what this is. It's all huh. one giant ending. Find the line again. Wait, and is we're that supposed where we to begin? restart the game. Begin following eight, the line. Find out a times? replica of the office has begun to That's deteriorate. Really Attempt to make the story. Uh, he hasn't forgotten about it's the adventure in the line again. Uh -huh. Yeah. So now, so according wait, to did this follow did exactly our? Then what, this is just what this path, supposed isn't it? to forget. Yes. Yeah, well, it doesn't actually. Okay. My mind goes blank. I was just making sure it didn't like actually like yes. update based on how you've been playing. It's just this. Well, this whole train looks like that. Why don't I get to decide? Hmm. Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? You're the narrator. No, it can't be. I don't, I don't we don't. We don't trust be. you anymore. I don't want the game to You've keep lost our trust. I don't want to forget what's going on. Seventeen oh, minutes of the confusion like ending. I won't restart Is that crazy that it takes seventeen it. minutes to like do it. follow I won't through this? Do it. He won't do it. And the time return uh -oh. stopped. Have we Does won? Mean, um, Is the ending over? Did we do it? Did we break yeah, the cycle? The um. Maybe. Did Whatever it bicycle? is that made this schedule. I like there's two How doors, so you know, know that you're going to end up in this room no matter which one you chose. Come for us? There was no Will logic. We just sat out there for three minutes, walking in a circle so, while he thought. Okay. And that's the story of the Stanley Parable as well. Yes, <laughs> now we just wait. Forcing you, you know, just to do things uh, arbitrarily way, until the narrator decides to let you do something Wouldn't different. Wouldn't you agree? I'm not yes, quite I sure agree. If we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always uh -huh. saying that life is about the I would say it's the best story. The destination. So I hope but that's I guess it is a right story. Now. So the adventure line we'll didn't fail us entirely? Eventually. And it tried to save us from this. Well, if we'd gone up in the ceiling, maybe we would have gotten a better ending. I hate that noise. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little like a jump scare because Gwen got a little jump scared. <laughs> Uh, I think that's all of his co-workers were gone. All the time we had. What could it mean? That we is had time indeed. Stanley decided to go to the meeting. All right, I got nothing left. I think for us to do in a really quick fashion. So, um, that's so. it. I think so. We've shown you just a handful of endings from the Stanley Parable today. There are many, many, many others, and I understand that the Ultra Deluxe version of the game that's coming out later this year, um, and will be available on console as well. That version will have even more new more dialogue, endings. new endings, I think, um, a bunch of stuff like that. So I hope you guys, if this looks kind of fun to you, 
uh, and you like to explore, break some things. Oh, that's that's a, there was but, one we could have done really quickly, and I didn't think to do it. But but can we find okay. the ball pit? No, no, you can't. There have been so many people Not in the yet. chat asking about the ball pit. Not yet. There's no ball pit ending from what I know of this game. Um, but there are definitely some easy endings you can get almost immediately um, out of the box of this game. So, uh, and if you do get it. Go ahead and think outside the box too. Don't just you know go looking for everything. Maybe try some weird things. You might be surprised the kind of uh, situations you can get yourself in, and the sort of things that the narrator reacts to. So anyway, cool game. Take a look at it. Hopefully you guys caught the musical today uh, and recognize some of our endings from this. If you have not caught the musical, or if you did catch the musical, oh. you can always go rewatch it or watch it for the first time on our channel. Watch it. On we'll repeat like it if you do until that. Next month's musical. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can also. Oh, you can't. I was gonna say you can go uh, stream it if you just want to like listen to the music and stuff. But I don't think it's available quite yet it's on Spotify yet. and stuff. I know it's been a little slow, but it should Weird. be there very quickly. Yeah, we submit it at the same time as usual, so they're just vetting it extra hard this time, I guess. I guess. Uh, either way, so yeah, thank you guys for joining us today, and thank you again to uh, the Stipendium. Um, for working with us on a musical for the Stanley Parable. He mentioned to me that he's been thinking about doing the Stanley Parable for years as well. So this is a game that a whole bunch of YouTube creators have either Let's Played or thought about making songs about and stuff, but it's been on everybody's radar for a really long time. And I'm really actually proud that we had the chance to put a, an original song about it out, um, possibly before some of the other music channels out there. Mm -hmm. so. And, and guys, it's still years late. If you guys think about it uh, and you want to go give him a little extra thank you, he did yeah. this for us on a super time crunch because he was in the middle of a bunch of things for uh, himself mm -hmm. and we kind of asked him last minute and he did an amazing job. So uh, go give him all the kudos in the world for not only doing this for us but for doing it so quickly and so perfectly. Mm -hmm. I'm sure he had to shuffle a lot of things in his own schedule to be able to do this. So, um, Do we have anything? I'm, I'm wearing a piece of merch here today. You are wearing yep. a piece of merch. There it is. Uh, you can wear it with a tie if you want to. It looks kind of <laughs> silly. But. Uh, the merch is available. I think you might even be able to find it on a shelf down below someplace. Uh, definitely on our main channel. And uh, we've got some new stuff there. In fact, almost everything is new compared to what has been there for like 10 years. So some of it's going to go away at the end of our 10th year here. Most of it, hopefully, will be sticking around for a bit. You can go take a look at that, see if any of it uh, appeals to you. Because anything you buy supports our musicals, just like Patreon does. Um, and that pays for things like... The stupendium to be able to carve out a little time from his own schedule. That's great. Some people have had to work for Random Encounters for free for years. Um, so it's really great that now we get a chance to pay some of the people to give up their time uh, and their talent to come work with us. Um, but it also buys, you know, things like ties. Because <laughs> you'd think I'd own ties, but I don't wear bow ties. So sometimes you have to actually buy a tie. <laughs> It's a really silly thing to have to buy. But um, the, the computer in there, again, it's old. The Stanley's computer is like super duper old. It's from like 2000 or something. Mm -hmm. But you just have to go to like a thrift store and get something like that. So you guys help support us um, by streaming the music, watching the videos, buying our merch, streaming our music, whatever it is, going on Patreon. That helps us pay for things. So thank you for doing that. Mm -hmm. And if you are not a t-shirt person, I just want to go ahead and plug in. We actually have some... I like to wear naked things. Uh, we wear, have some other merch if you would prefer to wrap us in other ways. For instance, we have some travel cups. We have stickers. We have bags and totes and things like that. So if True. you just you can wear any of those person, instead. you can totally you wear want. a tote bag. If you would like. You, you can do well, it. It probably fits your <laughs> head. Eye holes I would it. say take a picture and, and send it to us. Murderer. But I'm a little concerned what we get sent. Oh boy. Um, we also are going to have a video up on RE Extra next yeah, week. Yeah, yeah, okay. We're going to have our bloopers from this musical, which I'm sure a lot of will them. include some cats, some buttons, There's some ball pits. Uh, there was a lot the of The cat stuff amounts that for happened. more than he deserves, I'll be real. <laughs> that guy shouldn't have been in like the bloopers at all, but like there was a lot of cat bloopers, unfortunately. Uh, unfortunately. Yes. But uh, if you want to make sure you catch that, go subscribe to RE Extra uh, and. Please do. There yes. might even be an alternate ending in the bloopers next week. Whoa. We tested two endings. I say tested. We filmed two endings. Uh, one with a cat and one not with a cat. So the one not with the cat will be included in uh, next week's video on RE Extra. RE Extra is our sub channel, our secondary channel. Um, it's linked on our main channel. You can go find it. And it's its own channel for all the behind the scenes and bonus clips. Um, including things like we have uh, another version of the song <coughs> I think that we're going to end up posting. Um, that has my vocals instead. It's what I sent to the stipendium. Um, that is, if you want to hear me do the narrator instead talking to myself, <laughs> it'll be like Stanley's inner voice, actually. Uh, maybe we'll put that one up. We also have an extended or expanded, I should say, version of Greg's recording 
um, that he did a whole bunch of extra stuff for us. And it's really goofy and I couldn't stop laughing. Maybe we'll put that one up too for you guys so you can hear like what happens when you just set the stipendium loose on your project Beautiful and you don't things. tell him what to do and he just decides he's going to wing it. You end up with this kind of crazy nonsense and we're like, it's almost distractingly funny. So we didn't use it, but we might put it up later because it is really funny and he put in a ton of work on these extra little touches all throughout the song. Um, eh? Yeah, so that's it. Oh. I don't, yeah. Subscribe to our three channels. Yeah. Go have a look at our merch. Yeah, and definitely Come this back one. here next week. Definitely this <laughs> one. Yeah, we must see you guys here next Friday. Uh, I don't know what we're playing yet. No idea. It's our 4th of July episode, I suppose. Oh, so, so something patriotic. Something patriotic. We'll have to think about it. We'll think about it, and uh, you'll see it about 24 hours in advance when we uh, get the stream going. So. That's right. Yep. That's, that's right. right. All right, guys. Thank you again for joining us. Please go take a look at the musical if you haven't, and we'll catch you next Friday. Beard salute. Woo!